what will win in a drag race between Ken Block's Audi S1 Hunitron and an Audi Sport Quattro S1 Group B rally car from 1985? Well, we're going to find out because I'm going to race them over the standing quarter mile. I'm Matt Watson, and you're watching Car Wow. Buy, sell, car wow. Let me tell you about this Audi S1 Hunitron. It has two electric motors, one on the front axle, one on the rear axle, so you have four-wheel drive. Combined, they put out 680 horsepower and 640 newton meters of torque. The car has a 53 kilowatt hour battery pack. As a result, it's quite heavy. It weighs in at 1,620 kilos. As for the price, it's gonna be in the millions. And that brings me on to that old Group B rally car. It has a 2.1 litre five cylinder turbo that puts out 500 horsepower and 480 newton meters of torque. It drives all four wheels via a quattro all wheel drive system and a six speed manual gearbox. The car is, of course, from 1985. What did you expect? In fact, the guy driving it, his dad used to work as a technician on the car during the rallies for Stig Blomquist. He's actually a rally driver himself. He's competed in various rallies. So he knows how to drive that Group B rally car, which is a good thing because it's rather expensive. It's valued at 1.7 million pounds. It's actually quite light compared to this. Weighs in at 1,090 kilos. Now, if you'd like to compare these cars stats side by side, pause the video now. Right, before we get on with the racing, a little bit of information for you. If you're thinking about selling your current car, you can do it very simply through CarWow. All you have to do is upload some photos, give a brief description, then dealers all across the country will bid on your car. You just pick the highest offer, they'll come to your house, take the car away and put the money into your account. It's so easy. And it's completely free. Right. Let's do this racing, but we need to do the customary car wire sound check first. So seeing as I'm in an electric car, I have to make the noise of an internal combustion engine car because it's the rules. So let me have a go. I'd say that was pretty accurate, wouldn't you? Anyway, let's have a listen to that Quattro S1. <laughs> Do you know what? I think I need to warm up my tyres. After all, you know, it's a Ken Block's car. Should be able to drift it, right? I can't see a thing. Oh, oh. was pretty good actually Steve but this just took off didn't it yeah just too much wheel spin I couldn't change gear quick enough do you want another go do you reckon you can do a better job yeah I'm sure I can well let's give you one more go because always best two out of three right it's only fair I've 
I've got to say, Steve, your launches are very good, but that just doesn't have the performance to keep up with this, does it? 40 years behind. <laughs> exactly. I know how it feels. So then what exactly happened? Well, the Hoonitron won. It completed the standing quarter mile in 10.1 seconds. The S1 Quattro took 11.6 seconds. Now we're going to have a rolling race from some miles an hour on a beat second gear. I'm going to call it in. Ready? Three, two, one, go. Boost. Oh, Dendo, that was too easy for you, mate. Oh, I forgot to say what was going on. <laughs> I got so excited with myself. So basically, I decided that I wanted to have a go in this old Quattro S1. So I kicked Steve out of his car. I'm driving this, and we've got three Tomlin one winner, Dindo Capello driving <laughs> the Hoonitron. Yeah, you were well done, congratulations. <laughs> you truly are a champion racing driver. You know, we're going to have a brake test from maybe 100 miles an hour. We're going to reach the line for the emergency stop. Let's see what happens. Braking now. <laughs> Dindo, what happened there, mate? Were you level? Were you going faster? What happened? Because you got absolutely destroyed. Sorry, Matt, but I can't hear you with the helmet. It's difficult to understand. For me. Were you happy with that or not? Yes, yeah, yeah, for me it's fine. For me it's fine. I was just uh, used you as reference because I didn't know where to break exactly. When I see you breaking, I break as well. Would you like another go or are you happy with that? I'm happy with that. I'm happy. For me it's fine. If I was him, I wouldn't be very happy at all. He got destroyed. There is one thing I'd like you to do, right? Seeing as you're in the Hoonitron, would you mind setting a quarter mile time in it? But what I want you to do is do a 360 in the middle of the quarter mile. Is that possible? Yeah, I will do a 360 only for you, but just if you are following me and you make a nice video about my 360. <laughs> <laughs> yes, we'll do just that. Let's head back to the start line. You set up in the middle of the runway. Okay then, Dindo. So I've jumped in next to you now. So the idea is when the starter starts you, you accelerate, 360, we're going down the runway, and then we'll time you over the quarter mile with my specialist timing gear here. Let's see what you can do, yeah? Yeah. No try. pressure. Oh. I'm worried.